Hi guys, this is Rusty7809. It's about 6.18 p.m. Central Standard Time on August 30th, 2017, and I'm sitting here thinking about artificial intelligence again. I'm telling you, because it apparently this machine learning is catching on very quickly, in my opinion, which is worth just what you paid for it and nothing. This is going to be a short video. <clears throat> you know, I'm sitting here with two machine learning devices, one from Amazon and one from Google. One is the Amazon Echo. The other one is the Amazon Home Assistant. And I'm amazed at what they can do and how quickly, how quickly they learn. I mean, I've only had them two days, and they get better and better. And the way, reason they get better is because, you know, they're gathering data from you, okay? In other words, you know, the way you speak, uh, your little idiosyncrasies, uh, and other things. Now, the algorithm that runs these, I, I'm not a mathematician, so I'm not sure. But they are, they're, ga they're like sponges. They're gathering data from me. And everyone that has these devices, whether it's an Echo or a, a Dot or a Amazon Home or a Siri or whatever they have in their home, and I'm, I'm, I'm not saying they're bad. In fact, I think they're wonderful. I, I, I like them. But they are, they're, they're actually mining your home for data because what makes the, what improves the algorithm, the learning algorithm, is data. The more data that it gets, the better it gets at what, who knows. So, you know, if you looked at it like, <clears throat> like drilling for oil. Data is the new oil. And Google and Amazon, Facebook, Apple, whoever, they're, they're drilling. And they're drilling right here. Okay? That's where they're drilling. And they're gathering data to use in a billion different ways to replace jobs or to... or not or to create things that will replace you in the workplace, not intentionally, but because that data that they gather can be used for all sorts of things, it's, it's, a, it's a gold mine. It's, 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 a <clears throat> it, it's, how, it's how the uh, artificial intelligence lives. Data is food for artificial intelligence. Uh, and so what's happening, it's not bad. You just, all you older people, including myself, I'm 72 and I've said that a million times, but, and the younger generation too. And now most, most of the millennials are in tune with this, uh, maybe on the outside, on the fringe or whatever, but they're kind of in tune with it. You know what I mean? They, they they understand that that uh, there's learning algorithms out there that are going to do things in the future that are going to be amazing, and they're already doing them. And the fact that I can say the A word to my Echo device, or my or say something to my Google Home and get a verbal response that's pretty good. Uh, is amazing, but the point of this video is just to let you know, in my opinion, and I know a lot of you have never thought much about artificial intelligence and machine learning at all, but I've thought a lot about it, and I think about it a lot. Why? Because I don't have anything else to do. That's why I've got time to think. It's amazing, isn't it? And uh, I see a lot of good coming from this if it's controlled because, you know, you can replace doctors, you can replace lawyers, 
You can do self-diagnosis by taking a, a, a smartphone and taking a picture of your eyeball and, you know, you, you, I must tell them what you're going to be able to do in five years. You know, a lot of them are saying 50 years, 30 years. Folks, this is coming quick, in my opinion, in my opinion. And who am I? I'm some wino in Central Texas, USA, living in a travel trailer, a 36, excuse me, 26 foot Jayco J Flight bunkhouse model. I full time RV, done that for 25 plus years. And uh, here I am in the middle of nowhere in Central Texas. But I do have time to think and read, and a lot of people don't. My recommendation for those individuals that see this video is to find out how artificial intelligence or machine learning may, may impact their job or their life, positively or negatively. I'm not going to judge that. But you better know, and you better know how it affects you and your family because it's coming. I guarantee you. And if you don't believe me, ask Watson. That's the IBM thing. Uh, believe me, it's coming. So I'm not, and this is not to scare anyone. This is just to push you a little bit so that you will check it out. You know, I mean, I'm a whatever you do for a living. Uh, let's just say you're a physician's assistant or a, a paralegal or a, a waiter or whatever, truck driver, whatever. Find out how this is going to impact your employment and be prepared. That's all. I'm just telling you to check it out. That's all. My opinion. Thumbs up. Carpe diem. Adios. Bye bye. From t buy USA made when you can drink plenty of water. It's not going to make any difference whether you buy USA made anymore. That's over. You know, there, there are no closed borders. There, there, you know, the, there's no, this is coming and it's worldwide. Okay, it's going to affect every human being on this planet. And that's just the way it is. And, and it's positive. There's so many positives in it. There's, there's just, you know, there's going to be cures for diseases that, you know, that have been, uh, been around for years. You know, cancer will be basically like, uh, uh, a cold or the measles or something it'll just be eradicated but anyway drink plenty of water three or four quarts a day take deep breaths breathe in through your nose deep hold it breathe out through your mouth why because that relieves stress but stretch walk keep your health and also keep this thing alive okay i'm 72 you know and I'm aware, you know, there, there's so much, we have, there's so much information out there. All you got to do is just reach out and pick the fruit and put it right here. It's there. It's all out there. All you got to do is ask the right questions. But be that, I have time to do it. A lot of people don't. So I'm just shortcutting a lot of things. And if you watch this video, all, it, all I want it to do is make you ask yourself the question, how will artificial intelligence affect my life and my family now that's machine learning same thing how will it affect me and my family if you have a family anyway adios amigos bye bye